Hello, good morning. Uh, I'm Seymour Segnet, the founder and president of MAGFAST. Uh, this is your uh, weekly update for, oh, actually a day later than normal. I apologize for that, June the 30th. I'm actually recording, I have to keep my voice down because uh, uh, in the uh, little neighborhood near where I live where I sometimes go for a walk in the morning. It's early Saturday morning, so. Um, uh, and I apologize that uh, we're a little later than usual and it's just me rather than the team, but um, yesterday, the whole team was just completely slammed with uh, customer service and engineering and uh, any number of any number of the things we're doing and I had to decide whether to take everybody off of their work to sit in a room and do the update or whether you'd prefer uh, that we stayed on the job so we stayed on the job and it's just me doing the doing the update uh, so I'm not gonna be answering questions I don't have a script or anything uh, with me or, or, or notes with me um, but do please keep um, keep your questions coming to hello at magfast.com, hello at magfast.com. If you're seeing us for the first time this week, uh, we're very, we're blessed that uh, a lot of uh, new folks have discovered Magfast in the last week and are uh, joining us, if it's your first time here. Uh, a prof uh, uh, profound and thankful uh, welcome. And I just wanna talk very quickly about our process. Uh, we've spoken about this uh, many times before, but I wanted to tell you uh, some news, some very good news that's come about as a result of it. I've told you over and over again that our approach is that we want to be slow and careful and get it right. Uh, basically everybody else in the charging business, almost everybody else in the charging business is just making stuff as a, is that beautiful lovely sound of the stream down there? Uh, they just make stuff as quickly as they can and as kind of junky as they can and we're taking the time to uh, to get it right. I think it's getting a bit bright there so I'm gonna turn around and come back again. Um, we, uh, we can now announce uh, a significant upgrade to what we have promised. Uh, wireless charging is relatively new, as you probably know, um, and the standard Qi, the, the Qi standard is at five watts, uh, which is one amp, which is basically what most, uh, what you normally get as a, as a kind of wired connection that comes with your original phone. Um, folks are working on, on kind of higher powered ones, but the problem is that they get very hot um, which means that they have to have fans, which of course is completely unsuitable. Uh, Apple have come up with a higher powered standard at 7.5 watts. So this is a 50% upgrade from the, uh, from the regular standard. And yes, I know people are gonna write in saying, well, yes, but I, I, I know someone who's working on blah, blah, blah. In terms of what's actually available, Apple is setting a very strong standard at 7.5. And, but of course they're doing it in an Apple way that isn't the same as other people's. It's kind of chi, but in Apple's own way. And we can now announce that we're gonna be supporting the Apple 7.5 watt uh, standard. Um, uh, I feel it isn't coming across quite as exciting as it actually is. That's a very, very significant upgrade uh, to, what, um, to what we had promised when we originally put this project together. And it's the second upgrade in just a few weeks. Uh, again, for those of you joining us for the first time or, have, who, or who missed it a few weeks ago, um, you know that one of the major parts of MAGFAST is that the um, Life Extreme product, that's the biggest power bank with the most power, lots and lots of recharges, just phenomenal. Uh, a, a few weeks ago we showed it you, we've got, we've now got that kind of mean looking bump in the design. We've increased the envelope to get even more power into it. Um, and MagFast Life Extreme, we promised it'll jumpstart your car. It will now jumpstart your small truck up to five liters. And we're testing to see if we can go even beyond that. So uh, this isn't the approach that everybody takes. In fact, it's the approach that very few uh, companies take. Uh, but we're really, really proud of it. Um, if I, across your screen, this is a multi, multi, multi-year journey and we're in the final long stretch at the moment. So I thank you for your support. I thank you for your kindness, uh, the outpouring of kind remarks online. Uh, not every remark is kind, but we do try to get to all of them. I think that's another thing I just want to say in terms of, in terms of setting standards. Uh, we want to be the company that's actually responding to everything. Um, even if it's just a little comment from someone who's checking us out for the first time or a concern from, from one, of our, uh, one of our incredible backers who's, you know, who's really put their trust in us and, uh, and backed us with dollars while we do this project. We want to be highly responsive. We kind of want to, we want to be the company that's doing it the way you would do it if you're doing it yourself. And we're not perfect, but we're, we're working really hard on it. And in fact, uh, I'm 
very fortunate that today, it's Saturday morning as I told you, uh, today in uh, seven hours, uh, I'm meeting with the founder of what I think is uh, the best, certainly one of the best uh, customer service organizations in the world to see how we can work together, what we can learn. We absolutely don't want to hand things off to some organization that doesn't care. Um, but there's a, what's that? I'm having a senior moment here. What's the beer that they say it's reassuringly expensive? Maybe it was, maybe it was a British advertising campaign from my youth. Uh, Okay, we're gonna get so many emails from the Seymour, you idiot. It's um, it's still Artois, I think. Was it still Artois? Reassuringly expensive. So, th so this organisation they call True Source. You can check them out if you like in Austin, Texas, um, and also in Ireland. Uh, they're reassuringly expensive because they're passionate about helping uh, companies that are growing quickly. Um, to just do an incredible job because you can't forever you know i can't you know i personally answer a lot of the online comments at the moment but is that what you want me spending my time doing and the answer is yes a little bit because it's really important to be in touch with our customers but you don't really want the guy who's running the organization who's responsible for making it incredible for you to be spending as much time as i spend on that at the moment my wife amy uh you know we didn't even add her hours up but i mean it's sort of two thirds of a working week that she spends on customer service at the moment. And it's not the, uh, it's what you do when you're starting a company, but it's not the ideal. And we wanna uh, always be, you know, we can never be on the, on the line of perfect, but we wanna always be moving towards it. So as you can tell, I need to be getting out on these morning walks a little more often because it's quite a gentle slope and I'm a little bit out of breath. Maybe I've been talking too much and breathing too, too little. So I'll wrap it up uh, there for now. Please keep your questions coming. Hello at magfast.com. Hello at magfast.com. Thank you. It's a privilege to serve you with our little charger project. I would, as we're surrounded by all of these beautiful uh, trees, I would remind you that uh, we are aiming over time to become the world's greenest charging company. And certainly today we're planting a tree for every charger that's ordered. I actually haven't done the math recently. Maybe I should add that up and get it for you uh, soon or next week. But um, the number that we've been quoting is 33,000 uh, more than all the trees in Central Park. So why don't I get an update for you on that? Because it's, it's quite a bit more than that now. Hello at magfast.com. God bless you. Thank you so much. I'll see you next week.